Good morning and welcome to Hidden Gems. My name is Arden Thomas. I'm the Syncom Small Talk Product Manager. Hidden Gems is where we show you features of the product that are very useful but may not be obvious. So today's hidden gem is the change list. Now, experienced small talkers are typically pretty familiar with the change list, but if you're not or you just want to see some basic use, look ahead. So the change list is basically a tool. Whenever you write code in Smalltalk, it goes out to a log immediately. The nice thing about this is if something happens where your computer crashes or you manage to do something that manages to crash the image, you can typically recover all the changes that you have made up till then. So let's show you some basic use where you can find it in our products from the launcher, Tools, Change List, I'll open that up. Now, say you've had the experience of writing a lot of code and then you had a power outage or somebody tripped over your power cord and your computer crashed. The way you can get that back is by File, Recover Last Changes. Now, if you wanted to go farther back into the log, you can recover changes and choose one of the one of the earlier snapshots but let's choose recover changes this gets everything that was in the log from your from your your prior save and up until up until the the log was last written now here's here's a typical useful pattern for using this tool and that is to come in here now a lot of times we want to get rid of some things that we don't want to load in. So what I typically do is remove, first remove old versions, and you'll see it strikes out things that it, that it knows are old versions, and then remove same code as system. Do those two things in exactly that order, and then forget all marked. Now what you'll have left is the code, the new code that was not saved, and you can replay it. You can replay everything from the top, or you can pick specific things, right click on them, and replay. So if there was some work that you want to bring back in, and some work that you don't because you want to discard it, you can be selective in that order. Of course, once you replay it all in, you'll, you'll come back out and you'll save your image and you'll be, you'll be back on track. If you have any comments, suggestions, please let me know. You can write me at athomas at syncom.com. That's right here, athomas at syncom.com. And I look forward to any suggestions, any feedback. And until next time, enjoy using Smalltalk.